What must I do to be rid of you? I will kill that woman, I swear it! Do not look upon me with scorn in your eyes! <laughs> you... It can't be! You're alive? <laughs> if that is the case, that can only mean you are another Imperial spy. Did you come here to kill me? Answer the question. <sighs> Am I? Uh, why am I even here? I know they won't come, but here I am anyway. How has it already been five years? Time stops for no one, I suppose. Huh? It's... it's you! What are you doing here? For me? Highly doubtful. So you were alive. What have you been doing all this time? Choking at a time like this. Well, if you don't wish to tell me, I won't try to persuade you. All that matters is this. Will you return to the Empire with me? As expected, I knew your answer before I had even asked the question. That means... We're enemies now, you and I. My teacher, the time for discussion has come to an end. Even though our swords may cross as they do now. Chosen paths never will. Goodbye, my teacher. When next we meet, one of us will breathe their last. Five years ago to the day. If things had continued on as they were, today would have been the Millennium Festival. Halt! Who's there? It can't be! Professor? Is it really you? But I searched everywhere and never found a trace. My teacher... What have you been doing all this time? Where have you been? Joking? At a time like this? You do realize it's been five years since you disappeared. Do you have any idea how guilty I felt? How broken my heart was? I searched high and low after you vanished. Although there was no proof, I somehow knew you were alive. All this time, I led everyone as best I could, and fought with all my heart. It's been a difficult path to walk alone. <sighs> Welcome back, my teacher. I'm so happy that you're safe. Five years such a short time, but it feels like an eternity ago. Do you still feel the way you did all those years ago? You said then that you would fight at my side no matter how many enemies we should amass. As for me, my resolve has not faltered. I'm determined as ever to see this through to the end. I will defeat the False Goddess. I will save this world from those creatures and give humanity its freedom back. So, my teacher, are you prepared to stand with me? 
I... I thank you. Truly. Now then, I assume you understand the situation at hand, yes? Another joke? Or... Are you telling the truth? I suppose you must be. In that case, I'll tell you all that has transpired as you slumbered these past five years. And that is where we are now. The war is at a stalemate. Dimitri is the new king of Fargus. It's clear that his territory will continue to support the church. Meanwhile, Claude's leadership has thrown the Alliance into chaos. He maintains neutrality in their internal conflict. The situation has created a deadlock. We've been awaiting an opportunity for our squadron to return to the monastery. With you in the fray, I believe the state of the war will shift immediately. The Church, as well as the Kingdom and the Alliance. The time has come to eliminate them all. Although we were of different houses, we were companions who lived and learned together. Some of our ranks are hesitant to battle against them. However, knowing that you're alive is sure to raise their spirits. Good. Well then, I believe it's time for a little reunion. The Black Eagle Strike Force never lost faith. They knew you were alive and have been awaiting your return. Let's not keep them waiting any longer. Slept, Teach. Pretty rude to keep a fellow waiting like that, wouldn't you say? What's with that surprised look, my friend? You didn't really think I'd given up on you coming back, did you? Can you feel it? A new dawn is finally here. Not just for us, though. No. For all of Fodlin. It's been five long years. Where have you been, Teach? You don't really expect me to believe that you've been napping this whole time, do you? <laughs> it's a good one. Except, that's not your lying face. I guess I've got no choice but to believe you. You're not exactly normal to begin with, so it's not a huge stretch to imagine you sleeping for that long. And this is where you say, just kidding, right? If this is a rib, now's the time to fess up. You must be insane, and yet... Uh, fine. I believe you, okay? But that means you don't know anything that happened after your last battle, right? I guess it's on me to catch you up. As you can see, Garrick Mach was crushed by the Empire and was never restored. The monastery is in ruins, and the town is in pretty bad shape, too. Can you guess why? Hmm. It would seem that's one possible explanation, since you insist that's what you've been up to. All we know for sure is that Rhea suddenly vanished during that battle five years ago. The Knights of Seros have apparently been searching all over Fodland for her. But the fact that this place is in ruins tells me they still haven't found her. True. I've got a mountain of questions I'd like to ask her after all. But I'm not so sure whether it would be good for her to return as the Archbishop. Rather, with her gone... Uh, never mind. This could be a dangerous conversation. Before we discuss the state of affairs in each territory... Are you hungry? You must be. It's not much, but I did bring some food with me. Let's eat up and go from there.